my mother-in-law knows who Wayne Gretzky is. That's all, all you need to know. There's someone who doesn't care about sports at all, and I think that's true of a lot of people. Uh, he's the most famous Canadian, and he's the most popular hockey player, and still he's been retired 20 years, and he's, he's a legend. And if you look back, Wayne going to the Kings in 88 was kind of the catalyst for this groundswell of interest in hockey because here you are bringing this very popular sport in Canada to the biggest state in the United States, and he became a household name with people who hadn't heard of him four or five years earlier. buying 40 Gretzky rookies in like, had to be 80 or 81, and they were $3 a piece. Um, unfortunately, I don't have them all now. I, I just have the one of them that I bought, but uh, it's been a long ride. The Tops, which was three bucks and probably 80 or 81, is now four four $450 um, ungraded. And the Opeachy is $1,000 ungraded. So, and, 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 and in the higher grades, it can go for significantly more money. Gretzky's rookie card was basically, you know, Topps calling me up and saying, hey, you know, Edmonton Oilers look like they're coming up your neck of the woods, Springfield, Mass. You know, Gretzky's in the league. He went from Indianapolis to Edmonton. Uh, they're coming into Springfield. You know, what are the chances of getting you to go down there? And, and I just said, okay, it's a little bit of a ride, but yeah, I'll go. Never been in the rink before. But realistically, I was, in my mind, I was going to photograph Gordie Howe. Gordie was playing for the Whalers. And, but obviously Gretzky's playing and, and uh, I remember I got him to come over to the boards and pose against the boards. It was very, very dark lit. <clears throat> Pictures there might have to be tweaked a little bit, but he played in the game and I shot him. And, but the key was I was shooting Gordy Howe too. You see what I'm saying? And I, got, I remember I have one image, Gretzky and Howe on a face off. But the photo of Gretzky literally is him skating from in between the crease and the blue line in that zone. I'm in the penalty box and he's literally just looking up at the scoreboard, probably checking how much time's left in the period. Click took the picture, took a few other pictures, and uh, lo and behold, the card comes out. But I don't pay that much attention to it. You see what I'm saying? The card comes out, okay. It's, I remember seeing the PO, and I think that year maybe I had, you know, maybe 20 pictures used in the set. There it was. I remember seeing Wayne Gretzky card number, whatever it is. When Wayne was down in Florida to congratulate Yager for going into second place in points, I am outside the dressing room wanting to go to the bench. And Gretzky, Wayne looks over at me again, one of those like, okay, do I know this guy? You know, do I know this guy? And then somebody came out and Wayne said something about, you know, bringing Yammer out and the door closes. And then I'm looking over again and Gretzky looks at me again. And we kind of like eye contact and I walk over and I said, Wayne, I just want to let you know I'm Steve Babin, I'm the Boston Bruins photographer. I'm down here shooting for up a deck, but I took your rookie hockey card. And he steps back and he goes, really? Where was I playing? You were playing in the last year of the WHA, probably two weeks left in the season. You were playing in a game in Springfield, Massachusetts against Gordie Howe. And he... <laughs> I said, I got to bring that card and put that in my bag. I says, because I just want to get a picture of you and I holding that card. I don't want you to sign it. I just want to get a picture of you holding that card. <laughs> you know, because to me that's, that's classic. You know, I probably got hundreds and hundreds and hundreds and hundreds, never mind thousands and thousands and thousands of, of, of sports cards. So uh, it's just another picture. You know, that's kind of cool, being a collector back in the day and, and, and seeing the cards that you, you have and seeing guys paying thousands of dollars for certain cards. I was saying, oh, geez, though. Oh.